crunch the meat. Raise class on the floor and relax. This exercise can help you avoid lower back pain and neck tired while still working effectively on your core. And imagine you are pulling your core muscles, make them straight. This is what we are doing. Did you feel it? planks. Start with high plank. Raise your toes, your arms straight, hold your tummy tight, press in and out and stay in this position for 30 seconds. Second move is low plank. Give your lower back a little bit off so you can avoid lower back pain. After weight loss or pregnancy, lower back pain is very common. We are going to make it easier to enjoy. I'm all up in the clouds, in Walking plank. This is probably a new exercise to some of you. Targets your core and lower up. Just walk in and walk back. Tighten your core muscles. This is the key to get the results. That's correct, being funky. That go in. I'm all up in the clouds, position for 40 seconds. You can see I'm breathing slowly and focus completely on my core. exercise. 
to try and follow along with me. So we are trying to connect your core muscles gradually. Route and use my hands to support my neck. This way I can focus on my core muscles. Of course, you can rest your head on the ground if you need, or just feel which way is more effective for you. Nice, so I'm gonna give it in tempo speed. exercise. Again, rest your neck on the floor if you need, but I feel it's more effective if you can lift it. exercise in this first part, mountain climber hold. You can see I don't go for speed. Each move I focus on tighten my core muscles. The slower you move and hold in this position, the more effective the exercise is. <laughs> like within one or two days and the level is more intense. These are the exercises you can do anywhere, you know, even in bed. So no excuse guys. Thank you so much for joining with me today. You can go for another round and I will see you real soon in my next workout. Bye! <laughs> Watch your chest and crunch. Keep your upper body relaxed. This can help protect your back, your neck and squeeze your ab muscles. Then extend your arm over your head while doing the reverse leg raise with your right leg. Squeeze your abs once again before you return to the crunch. 
The combination of three movements will stretch your core muscles to the max. There is no pain in this exercise, very enjoyable. position. Extend your legs, raise your hips, arms overhead, and toes pointing toward the ceiling. Lift your butt in this position. The main focus is your abdominal muscles. The bridge also targets your glutes. However, with the legs extension and arms overhead, this will add more stretching level to your abs. The muscles will be stretched in vertical position. Use your hand to support your neck or rest on the floor if you feel tired. Keep your legs off the ground the entire duration. Feel it everyone, your lower up. We are pulling them straight. Squeeze your muscles harder. You will get the maximum benefit out of this exercise. Easy and effective. combination movement of plank jump and side mountain clamber. We will do it in a low impact cardio. You can walk in and walk back if you don't want to jump. I have more intense version of this exercise on Instagram. Just follow and fit collection for more advanced training level. Very nice. Keep that going guys. in bicycle my all-time favorite easy and effective exercise for your lower app keep squeezing your core muscles guys beautiful keep going keep pushing yourself <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
Here is a new move for you. Raise your legs in a butterfly position. Use your hands, hold your thighs and raise your head. We are going to hold in this position for 45 seconds. While holding, I want you to squeeze your lower abs as hard as you can. The muscles are closing in this position until you release the holding. So make the best out of this exercise, everyone. Well, enough to pay my rent, but not enough to forget about you. And I only have one on my heart. Say, so let me know, look me in the eye. Cause it's all good to keep all the darkness inside. Hold up, like, who wanna be a bitch that broke for living in Paris with a terrorist? I only care about that. The next move is side mountain climber. Keep the walk in tempo speed. Each step you move, I want you to squeeze your lower up as hard as you can. This exercise is quite challenging. Keep going guys, keep pushing yourself in 60 seconds. 60 seconds is a very small percent of your day, but you will feel good all day. That's beautiful, keep going. <laughs> Start in a V-sit position, hands firmly on the ground, bring your legs in towards your chest. Try not to move intensively. Feel your core muscles if they are doing their job. Moving too hard or too fast will put more focus on your internal obliques and thighs. But I want to focus on lower up, so keep it in tempo speed. Awesome everyone. <coughs> is reverse rainbow. You will instantly feel your ab muscles moving towards the opposite direction. And yes, that is our goal. We are going to connect all the core tissues muscle. Recreate. <laughs> today plank jump to beer plank and knee touch three movement combination all targets your lower belly your core and internal obliques if you are tired just walk instead of jumping 
These are all the exercises that I can temporarily share with you to heal your diatesis recti and midsection, as performing incorrectly exercises can lead to long-term healing. This is also our last workout of 2019. Remember to share your progress on our community page, Instagram, in Fam. I'm going to create 2019 fitness journey of our community, featuring all of you. So send me your videos, your workouts, your words, anything you want to be featured in the video. Thank you so much for joining with me today, everyone. And I will see you real soon. Bye.